beautiful people, Paisley Rose back again with another tutorial for you guys. So today I'm bringing you guys this smoky liner eye look. Um, I just wanted to do something simple, something with cooler tones, even though it's still got some warm tones in there. But I can't just do a full on cool tone eye because it just does not look good with my skin tone. But I did use some green today. I don't normally use greens, blues, or purples because once again, I just don't like them against my skin. But today I used an army green to create this green smoked out liner. So if you looking to get this gorgeous, then just um, keep on watching. So I already started off with my base, with my concealer, contour, and eyebrows. And now I'm going to go do one eye off camera and then I'll be right back. All right, went and did this eye, burring you guys closer. So you can see there's a bit of caramel over there, a bit of green, a bit of brown, a bit of black. We got a smoky liner going on. So we're going to start off with our bobby brown caramel and a fluffy brush. And we're just going to kind of just place this all over, not all over, up to the crease but starting at the base and then we're gonna wing it out too just like that now we're gonna go into our smoky professions palette and we're gonna take an angled brush we're taking an army green color and we're going to run that right along the eye and this is the one color that we are going to try to create the wing shape with the other ones we are just going to enhance the shape if that makes sense so winging it out just like that. And then we're going to take a flat brush and we're going to just take the top of that, dip it into Bookworm from our Beauty and the Beast palette. And we're going to run that way lower than the green and keep it as close to our eyelashes as possible. Then going back in with the green and smoking that color out. Going in with our Kat Von D tattoo liner and we are going to keep this really close to the lash line and we're barely winging this one out. Then we're going to go back in with our army green. We're going to try to blend that out or smoke it out. And just like that. I know it looks messy now, but we're going to go back in with concealer and clean it up. And then we're going to take a clean pencil brush. And we're going to blend out the green into caramel. Just barely. Just like that. Now taking some concealer on the back of my hand and a small flat brush. We are going to clean that up. Now we are going to go in with Carmel once again and the fluffy brush and we are going to bring that right along the lower lash line. Taking the army green and smoking out the lower line. Taking bookworm, smoking it out some more. 
then finishing it off by going in my waterline with a black pencil. I'm going in and curling my lashes. Doing some mascara. I'm going in with some lashes. Alright, now that we're done with that, we're going to zoom y'all back out and finish up my face. Using my Melanie blush and a blush brush, I'm going to just plop that onto the apples of my cheeks and then swoop it over to the bridge of my nose and go over that. Just like that. Then, oh, I forgot one thing on my eyes. Going in with my e.l.f. Cosmetic um, Heart Collab Highlighter. I'm going to use the white one and put that oh, on the other side, in the corner of my eye. And then use my mini fan brush and put that on my brow bone. Then for highlighter, I'm going in with my Fenty Beauty Highlighter in Hustler Baby. And I'm going to use my giant fan brush like I did the other day because it looks beautiful. Okay, that was probably, that was probably quite a bit, but whatever, right? Putting it on my forehead and my cheekbones. <laughs> you know what? I'm also, first, I'm going to go in with these new drops that I got and they're just like sparkly but I got it from Walmart and I'm just going to drop some of that onto my chest just like that and then I'm gonna rub that in just with my hands just so it gives this highlight as some base and also it gives me some glow but now I'm going to take my Fenty Beauty highlighter and I'm going to do my collarbone too real quick. Because, <laughs> oh why not? You want my shoulders too. Then I'm going to take my Max brush real quick and put that right onto the tip of my nose, the divot of my nose. And these sides. Coming closer because I realized I was way far away. <laughs> Come on, Paisley. And then I'm going to take my tattoo liner once again and go over my natural beauty mark. Now, real quick, going in with my flower seal the deal long lasting matte finish setting spray, and I'm gonna set my face. Then fan that in to make sure all the powders and creams go together. It's an interesting setting spray. It smells interesting. I don't really like the smell and it feels a lot like more I want to say it feels strong but it feels also like just you know what I mean you know what I mean but oh what is this and also left white marks interesting all right not my favorite but I'm gonna give it a try again and do it from further out and maybe shake it up a bit 
but not today because I already did it. <laughs> Whatever. All right, now I'm gonna go in with some lipstick. I'm gonna use my Kat Von D lipstick in Lolita. And this is your guys' finished look. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this tutorial. I enjoyed doing it for you. I like the finished look. Um, please like and subscribe to my channel look because I know you want to. I will see you beautiful people later.